Uh, my name's Don. Hello? Huh? Shut up. Uh, you sound like you're on heroin. Uh, my name's Don. I don't have many passions in my life. But one thing I'm very passionate about is Doctor Who. Yeah. Oh, another virgin in the front row. <laughs> Lovely. Nice to greet you. Oh, very nice. I like you. You look like an Egyptian blow-up doll. You're wonderful. You're very sexy. Oh, I could run my fingers with those curls. Lovely. They're like pubes. It's wonderful. Yeah. But I was very happy to see that the first black and gay doctor was announced, Shudi Gatwa, and I think that's amazing. Woo! Very... Mm. Bring back ten. <laughs> this isn't a fucking Comic-Con Q&A, mate, you know. Yeah. The only thing I fear, though, for the next season is I don't think this new doctor will be travelling back in time very much. Because of history. You know history? Yeah. My, uh, my friends say I'm like a mole. Because when I take off my glasses, I have small beady eyes. I can't see very well. And I like to have sex with moles. Mm. Mm. Love that shit. No beaver for me, just mole. Uh, I, I'm bisexual. Why'd you go, ah? Uh? Oh, it's just, okay, good. Uh, yeah, uh, some people are surprised when they hear I'm bi because I'm not camp. I just look like a living one. Uh, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I didn't come out until I left home because I'm from the most accepting place in the world, Northern Ireland. <laughs> they love it there. Yeah. The, I'll give the idea, the, the idea of the mentality of my school. One of the boys shagged the female hockey coach. Yeah. <laughs> He's in tonight. <laughs> And uh, it got out to the local press, and we were reading the newspaper, and the headlines were saying, you know, that poor boy, his innocence was stolen. He must not feel safe to go to that school. Nope. Attendance was never higher, I'll be honest. We were all walking in with our fingers crossed. Hopefully it's me today! That's what we were saying. And uh, we, would, we would study RE, you know, religious education. And I, you know that one vague line in the Bible? Man shall not lie with an... You know that one? Yeah. <laughs> Fucking autocorrect? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> yeah, and uh, we'd read other verses in the Bible, you know. Noah's Ark. Uh, he built that ark. Uh, the, oh, Daniel, it's more of a metaphor, okay? It's what you take away from the story, yeah? Uh, Jesus, he fed the 5,000. Did he? Oh, da Daniel, it's more of a metaphor, okay? It's what you take away from the story. Man shall not lie with another man. I had some black and white, you fucking fruit, yeah? It was a God's words, not mine. Like, imagine God came down right now. The Amazon is burning. Everyone's getting shot. What the fuck? What the fuck have you guys done? Oh, it's okay, God, it's okay. There's no gay bomb sex happening. No. Straight in the vagina. Oh, oh that's how we like it. Very good. Sometimes uh, I go into the toilet and put a chair against the door and climb into the urinal so it feels like I'm back in the womb. Ooh. Ooh. I love it there. It was just safe. It was safe. You just napped all day. It was... Do you like napping? Do you love it? Do you know what the worst way to wake up from a nap is? Being fucking ripped out of your mouth's fanny. 
It's a rude awakening, that. Yeah. I did have sex once, though. Yeah, yeah. And I met this girl at the club, and uh, I took her back to my place, and uh, we did the, you know... Um, <laughs> 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 uh, sex. And uh, I, I rolled over after, after we had both climaxed, and... Uh, uh, I said, oh, this was really fun. We should do this again sometime. Are you free tomorrow? And she said, oh, no, sorry, I have school. <laughs> Fuck me. That's what I said. That's what I, I got Hands down, Leon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. And I said, Fuck, what age are you? And she said, oh, don't worry, I'm 32. I'm a hockey coach. <laughs> uh, so that was that. Dan McCrane, you've been lovely. Thank you so much. Thank you, everybody.